There is a major threat in the Arctic and Antarctic climate. Fossil fuels, which I highlighted because it's a special word, are being burned, warming the Earth. The Earth is supposed to be warm, but not too warm. And that's how it is. Climate change is a big problem. And since we're younger, we're the future of, of the rest of our planet. I think maybe we should work on it and then we can earlier. get better earlier. earlier. So like, it's easier to study now because then you can learn even more when you get older and older and older. We can collaborate with other scientists so if they thought something else, we can tell them the real truth about Two shovels. Three shovels in the hole. Three shovels in the hole. Jamie, Listen, If I got the roots in the uh, ground, should I put the tree like this? No. 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 Like this? No. no. This? No. no. Should I just keep spinning yeah. it? Yeah. <laughs> in the middle. You have to cover in the middle. It up How do I know? How do I know? I don't know because because that's where the roots no, have to spread. I want it to be balanced. I love the way you guys are doing this. No. no. Exactly. Conserve water. We won't have to waste some of our natural resources as much. Yeah. And it's just conserving everything we have in the world. So we're putting the Ms. holes Rebecca? in here so we can yes. plant the seeds in uh, each column. Make, uh, a hole with our finger. Katie, look what Nine we holes you have to do. Because trees help us breathe, and the less trees we have, the harder it will be for us to breathe. Well, each plant should grow different, differently depending on the amount of fertilizer put in. Okay. It can be applied to real life, whereas, say, if you're starting a garden, it would be helpful to know, um, start learning about why fertilizer is helpful if you need fertilizer, and just kind of learning about plants and learning about how each of them has its different needs, kind of like people. Let's put, let's put F there and then we'll see. And I saw how a lot of fish can't live without dissolved oxygen because that's how they breathe. So, and with warmer waters, there's not as much dissolved oxygen. And since we have rising ocean temperatures, then that's why a lot of fish are dying. I'm recycling and I also turn off the water while I'm brushing my teeth and I stop playing video games. Unplugging the things that I don't need. Uh, everybody in my family, we're taking um, like really short showers, like five minutes. We're picking up trash so that we can keep our streets clean and safe for the environment. Well, we just know it's really important because we found so much trash and it, there were so many of us and you realize, wow, if it's just like two people that are picking up like 25 glass pieces, that's like a lot. And yeah. if there's more, way more people doing it, we can make a really big difference.